Again? Again. Well, what are they in for? Well, it looks like clouds. So I'm seven months pregnant and I'm not cleaning that up. But you're home early. How do you feel about being poor? Like more poor than we are now? Yeah. How much more? Is pauperish a word? Why are we excited about being poor? I think I need to write a letter. To whom? All of them. What kind of letter? Like an ultimatum. Whatever you do, do not call it that. told you not to give them an ultimatum. It's not an ultimatum. How is it not an ultimatum? If a bunch of people are gonna go jump off a cliff, but I decide I don't wanna go because I prefer to live, that's not an ultimatum. No one is jumping off of a cliff, Chris. Can we just get to it? You're upset because I went over your head to the board. I don't see what the big problem is with just making a few people happy once in a while. That is the problem. That's what landed Israel in the desert for 40 years wandering around. And this is not the same thing. It's exactly the same thing. Every church goes through this at some point, whenever there's change involved. You just happen to have the short end of the stick at the moment. Here, put up, yeah, just a minute, guys. Oh. This music, it's really loud. I'm sorry, I'll see about that. Thanks. Look, I'm trying to do you guys a favor, okay? Because all those people died. Who died? The people in the desert. Every church goes through this. It's always painful and it's always slow. It's slow because you're dragging your feet. It's slow because you're spending all your time calling everybody, making sure they're happy. And you aren't thinking clearly. You can't just go throwing out ultimatums all over the place. You're going to find yourself without a job. Well, thanks for showing your concern now. Do you have a job lined up? Something I don't know about? Does it have insurance? 401k? I don't have a 401k now. Kennedy's doing like two months. If you get fired, what are you going to do about insurance? Jimbo said he's going to call you. Look, what you got to do is calm down. You're a young guy, Chris. You already did. I'm 30. 30 is not young. Oh, it's so young. You're practically a kid. I wish I was 30. <laughs> I mean, I get it. I really do. You're young. You got passion coming out your ears. And, and he said I was young. And you are young. You're five years older than me. What you really got to do is you got to calm down. Calm down? Yeah. You can't look at this thing angry. I'm not angry. You're not angry. No. I was angry. I feel better now. Angry people give ultimatums. This is not an ultimatum. It's a consideration. I don't understand. It's like when Moses went into the promised land. You know, he sent the spies in to check it out. They went in, they checked it out, they came back. They had a consideration. Go in or don't go in. Right. And then they went in. No, you're remembering the story wrong. Listen, Chris, we love you. We do. You and your lovely wife. But this is not a black and white issue. How is this not a black and white issue? I thought Joshua had the spies. They both had the spies. Wait, I thought Joshua was a spy. He was. Well, what's the difference? Joshua saw things black and white. Moses took a vote. I think we know what we have to do here today. We need to take a vote. I'm really sorry. Music? I'm sorry, I can't turn it down. You can't turn the music down? It's policy. 
Hollis. Part of the atmosphere. He's upset because his food's wrong. I'm so sorry. Let me go fix that for you. Oh, no, 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 no. Everything's fine. It's supposed to be chicken. I'm so sorry. Everything's just great. Are you sure? Everything's great. Thank you. I'm sorry. If y'all need anything else, just let me know, okay? Now, why'd you do that? What? Look, I'm a pastor. And I need to be accessible to people. I can't do that if I just go running every waitress off that gets my food wrong. You gotta think about your family. Think about my family. You know how many of the spies made it? Two. The rest of them died. That's how Joshua died? No. Is this really worth going to bat for? I mean, it's your job on the line, bud. Jim, the problem is, is that you think this is about my job. You still don't get it. Shepherding is about taking care of people. You can't have this attitude that this is the way it is, and if you don't like it, get out. All in favor? I want to start a television network. You want to do what? What do you think of that? <clears throat> you don't look 30 years old. No, I mean, my family, we naturally seem to run where we look younger, but I am. What are you doing? I think I might grow a beard. Are you doing that right now? As a matter of fact, I am. Uh, yeah, but you don't look it. Are you sure that you're 30? Is that like, are you rounding up to the nearest 10? No, I'm not rounding up. I really am 30. You know when you're 40, they'll say you look 30. So it's a good thing. Anyway, you don't look 30, you look young. Especially for a campus pastor. I figure, you know, I mean, I'm 30. Jesus was 30 when he started. So, I mean, that can't be the worst thing in the world to just look young. You just compare yourself to Jesus? Not to Jesus, just that we shared the same age. I mean, But we Jesus all... probably looked older than 30 when he started, too. Yeah, he was a That's probably why people listen to him. He was a mature-looking messiah, you know? I, I could grow a beard. Thank you for coming in. It's a no. Yeah. Oh, your dad called. He wants you to stop by the office. You want to do what? I want to start a television network. You don't know anything about TV. I watch TV. Yeah, you know nothing about TV. Look, I was traveling and I had this thought. People need to see what God's doing in the world. Well, they can, they got the uh, evangelism network. No, no, no pastors, no churches, no big haired makeup people. I want real people, normal people, people you never heard of. People out doing crazy things just because God told them to. I think God wants us to start it. You just said us. Well, I don't know anything about TV. I know. But you do. I know some about TV. Look, my question is, is it possible? 
Well, yeah, I mean, I'm sure it's possible if you did, you know, if you had manpower, money, resources. I mean, it would take a tremendous amount of research for something like this. Mm, well, I don't have time for that. Well, you kind of have to make time for that. Okay, that's what you're for, okay? I'll fund it and you set it up. <laughs> set it up? It's not like it's a birthday party. I figured it'd only take a couple years. Oh. I don't know why I'm freaking out about it then. Well, well, how hard can it be? Very. It can be very hard. A network's gotta have content. Where would you come up with content? Well, we'll make it. Or you'll make it, or most of it. Maybe we'll network some. I mean, I don't know. But no pastors and no churches. Okay, that's the last thing this world needs is a bunch of pastors seeking stardom. Oh, I think there's a bunch of things you're not considering here. What is it? Well, this is our new 22.3 megapixel DSLR camera. Megapixel? Yeah, I think it just, I think there's a bunch of them. Why do you have this stuff anyway, man? I thought you were doing like video. Well, no, I mean, these things do video now. Well, what are you doing with it? I'm trying to figure out how you turn it on. Well, you don't know how it works? Well, not yet. I mean, that's why you gotta have the manual, except it's all in Chinese. Well, what about all this stuff? Like, what's in the box? Well, okay, so this other equipment, and this is our new, you know, editing computer for, like, you know, when we go to edit the footage. You know how to do that? Well, not yet. Oh, my. I mean, how hard can it be? They got, like, a million people on YouTube now that do it, so it can't be that difficult. Well, I can see you really thought this stuff through, man. Well... I think I just took your picture. Okay, so, assume we make some shows. Then what? Well, we make some more. But, you know, how do we distribute them? We don't have a way to broadcast. We use the internet. We use IPTV. Well, what's IPTV? Internet television. Yeah, but I mean, what's it stand for? I don't know. Internet television. There's no P in internet television. What about like lights and tripods and like all that stuff? Yeah, we don't have any of that stuff. We just don't have any of it. No. We have the sun. The sun seems to work pretty well most of the time. What about a crew? Like don't we need lots of people to do a movie? Okay, no, we don't have a lot of people. We have you. Me? I have a job. Well then it's, you know, you and me unless you're working and then it's mostly me. Yeah. Hey, I did get something cool though. You need a name and a logo. I was thinking something clean, like light. Like, wow, this burden is so light? Well, the other kind of light. Like, it's bright in here. Hmm. Nope. None of them? Every domain, taken. What the heck is this? This is our new table. And why is it in my office? TV networks are all about money, but we don't have any money, so we gotta be, you know, different. Okay, that still does not explain why this hideous table is in my beautiful building. Oh, it's people. People are gonna be the heart of everything we do at this company. So one day people can come in, they'll sign our table, and that way, no matter what we're doing, this will always be in front of us. Wow, I've got gum. Yeah, uh, there's a few spots. I haven't scraped it yet. Why are their names already on it? We can't start with a clean table. We gotta start with something like this. Is that a bad word? There's no bad words on the table. That's a bad word. Okay, get a Sharpie. You think they could spell it right? Nope. Are you serious? So what do you think? I mean, I was going for something clean, with the curvature of the earth and the light rays bouncing off of it, as if we were reflecting the light of the world. No, I hate it. What? What about this? That could work. 
Okay, so how about this one? I tried to stay with the same light refracting thing. No. Why not? No, stop thinking 2001. I mean, we're not NASA. This could be used by, well, NASA. It's free. You're kidding. Dot com, dot net, dot biz. What about dot TV? Okay, so you're gonna make a movie. It's more like shows than a movie. With a camera that you don't know how to use, a crew of two people, maybe, and an editing program that you don't know, and then what? Well, then we share it. With who? Everybody. Well, I hate to throw a wrench in your foolproof plan, man, but how are you going to make money? Oh, jeez. We're going to need to make this nonprofit. Really? Yeah, I mean, if we're going to make all this stuff and put it online for free, we've got to make money somehow. we we'll make ourselves a nonprofit and raise support. I mean, how hard can that be? People do that all the time. Well, yeah, that could work. Now, I realize to pull this thing off is going to take a lot of time. So it would mean you quitting your job. Well, about that. Seriously, breaking and entering? Well, technically there are no signs saying we're not supposed to be here, so... We're not supposed to be here. Probably not, no, but there are no signs saying it, so... We can feel better. I don't feel better. What's the worst that can happen? We could get arrested. We're not gonna get arrested. I mean, that's just... dramatic. I mean, if anything, we might get, like... a stern talking to, or maybe escorted from the building harshly. I mean, that's it. What are we even doing here? Well, we don't have a lot of money for like, you know, sets and stuff, so we have to get creative. And this place always has our doors unlocked. I just took your picture. I'm oh, here, let's try this. We're gonna go to prison, man. We're gonna go to prison. We're not gonna go to prison. Okay, can we make this fast? Yes, let's go. Hey, you realize I have no idea, no idea what I'm doing here, right? I mean, I feel like I'm getting ready to burn a dead cat. Look, you just point it at their neck or their chest. You'll be fine. I thought I was supposed to point it at their mouth. No, you point it at their neck or their chest. That doesn't make sense. They speak out of their mouth. It's what the tutorial said. In the tutorial? I don't know everything, okay? I'm figuring hey. out... Hey! Are you guys supposed to be up here? Um, well, we're f with the film people today. Film me here. Does Sharon know about this? Uh, well, you know, I don't know. I spoke to Taylor about it. Did uh, they talk to you at all about it? Okay, technically that wasn't a lie, so I think we're okay. He didn't look happy. No, obviously. You know I've got about five minutes before that stern warning you were talking about. Karen, perfect timing. This is a really cool place. Yeah, it's gonna be really cool in about five minutes. Chill. So, what do I do? You were there every step of the way. Though I found myself lost in the flames. You shut the lion's mouth, carried me out, and your faithfulness has ever remained. 
Yes, your faithfulness has ever remained. And cut. How did I do? I think it was really good. It did good. spectacular, but we're going to go ahead and talk about this somewhere else. No, we have time for one more. Nope, no, sir, we are done. We're going to need it. one more. Nope. don't have an audience. For the show? We put the show out there, but it is not getting watched. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get people to click one small button? It will get watched. I was thinking I could take a picture of me with a sign that said, help me find my long lost twin. And that would probably get a million likes. Or even like my teacher says, I can't get a thousand likes. Help me prove her wrong. And that would work, but like this, I mean, I, we can't control this. You'll think of something. I actually saw a picture of this girl holding a sign that said, if I get 999 likes, daddy will quit drinking. And apart from the fact that that's horribly sad, that had 14,000 likes, 14,000. Look. It's going to take some time, but it will get out there. Who goes out to build a television network without an audience? I mean, how did I not see that this was going to be a problem before now? Bringing an audience was never your job. Your job is to build a network. Yeah, but those things go hand in hand. Look, did God tell you to do this thing or not? Do you follow God or do you not? In the end, you have to make the decision. Do you build a network or do you not? But bringing an audience was never your problem. Well, the audience is kind of a problem. The audience will come. So how many views now? We are right under a thousand. So what are we going to do about it? We do the next thing. Well, don't we need to get the views up first? Well, 
we can do that, but we can either spend the money on marketing or we can do the next thing. We can't do both. Hey, can I help you? Uh, yeah, I'm looking for Chris. You know what's funny? I mean, I tell all my friends about this. Okay, now these are Christian people. I say, go check out what we're doing. I mean, you'll like it. It's got an awesome story. Then they don't watch it. I mean, I would think that they would since they know me. But I see them week after week, and I say, have you, have you watched it yet? And they say, well, I've, I've been meaning to. I keep forgetting. I mean, these are the people that I would think would be interested in watching something like this. I know. I don't know what it means. Well, maybe it just takes some time. Maybe. Well, can't take too long. I mean, those cat videos go viral, don't they? Well, we could get a cat. No cats. Hmm. I'm still kind of discouraging, though. Yes, it is. Hey, guys. You got a visitor? Oh, thanks. Hey, guys. I'm Dwayne Porter, producer at BCEN. What's BCEN? We're a digital broadcast network. You haven't seen us? No. I don't watch much television. <laughs> well, I saw that video you guys put up with Karen. You did? How? A friend of mine. He tagged me in the video. I liked it so much, I showed it to all the guys at work. Now I'm here to discuss with you guys, letting us share your content. When you say share our content, what is it you mean exactly? Uh, we would broadcast it on our network. Where do you broadcast? Every major city in Texas. <laughs>